everyone so I was thinking like what kind of video can I do and then it dawned on me I was like I am a mom I can do mommy must-haves so this is gonna be like um a new mom must-haves because I remember the things that helped me so much and I wish everybody knew about them so I'm just gonna share some mommy must-haves with you that I think are like essentials and that I get my friends because I think that they should have when they have babies and stuff like that so I don't have a lot of these products in front of me um I will put links to all the products I can find um down below a lot of them since my kids aren't brand new anymore I don't have with me but I mean I still remember so the first thing are gas drops. You do not want to be caught without gas, gas drops, I promise you. Um, even if your baby isn't super gassy, there's going to be a night where it's going to happen. I mean, it happens in every baby, it's just how it goes. So you have got to have gas drops on hand. Um, they're, they sell them at Target. I'm pretty sure they sell them at Whole Foods. They have them everywhere. I forget the name of the ones I always got. I think it started with an M, but I'll link it down below for sure because they're super popular and the ones, um, they're the ones that everybody knows for like gas drops for kids. Those are amazing. Also, Highlands makes, um, colic pills. They're like the teething tablets, but they're colic. And my son was super colicky, so we would do gas drops and the colic pills. They're all natural, and they just help to kind of calm his stomach a little more, um, a little more than the gas drops do. Those That just kind of helps release the gas so they can get it out easier. The I'm not exactly sure what the colic pills have in them. I forget the ingredients, but I know it helped a lot. My son was very colicky and um, those did work and we always had them in stock. Um, I mean, get them even if you think it might be an issue or it, I mean, really these things are like so important. You don't it's okay if you don't use them. It's just things that you don't want to be caught without. Another thing, this is just my opinion. The Dr. Brown's bottles are the best bottles I have ever used. I've used a lot of different bottles. Um, my son, like I said, was so colic. My daughter was five weeks premature and Dr. Brown's bottles were the only thing that helped. We used a lot of different bottles with my son and once we switched to colic pills and Dr. Brown's, his colic seriously stopped. Like, it was he was obviously getting too much air and he just wouldn't stop. It would be eight o'clock every single night we could time it and he would start crying and screaming and wouldn't stop for hours and it just nothing helped I'm not even kidding when we started those dr. Brown's bottles he stopped like within a few days it was amazing I am obsessed with those I get them for my friends I got them when I had my daughter like if I have any other kids I will always get those I don't use any other ones I always go back to dr. Brown's um Another thing is the butt paste um, diaper rash cream. My daughter had a really bad diaper rash all the time and it was hard to catch up on because she just kept going. And when you're, they're so little, it just rubs them raw. So um, the butt paste, it's in the yellow tube and it's literally called butt paste. Um, that stuff is amazing and it helps so much like seriously my daughter would have a diaper rash to where it was bleeding and we put that on her and the next day it was almost gone I serious I still use it for her now if she gets a bad diaper rash um it's amazing I love that stuff I've tried desitin we went through tubes and tubes of desitin and it never worked um it's too creamy and it doesn't 
like absorb like it's supposed to. Um, also, I'm pretty sure that the butt paste is natural. I want to say it's natural. I mean, don't quote me. I'll leave the link below so you can see. I'm not 100% for sure, but I know that it works so much better than Desitin. It's a little more expensive, like maybe by a dollar or two, but it is so worth it. And it is, oh, seriously amazing. The next thing for mommies is nipple cream, the lanolin nipple ointment stuff that's just like Vaseline pretty much. That will save your life when you are breastfeeding or even pumping. Um, your nipples will get so raw and hurt so bad and you have to have something to soothe that. And that lanolin, um, it's a lanolin Vaseline pretty much and it helps keep them moisturized so they don't crack and it just helps kind of soothe them because it it gets irritating so that is an amazing product also um also let's see what else did i have with my son he was like the hard baby my daughter was definitely so much easier maybe because we knew what we were doing but I don't know, my son was just like crazy. <laughs> we definitely learned everything from having him. Um, obviously breast pads, I don't think it matters what kind, just kind of your preference. I know some of them have little sticky things where you can stick it to your bra so they don't slide around. Um, I just got what it was ever on sale. It didn't really matter. Oh, also, Johnson & Johnson makes um, it's like, in, it comes in a box and it's like washcloths and they're pre-soap washcloths. And you can, I used that for my son when he was just born and it is amazing because they're, they're pre-soap so all you have to do is get it wet and like wash it or rub it together and then it's already all the soap you need to wash their little body and it's perfect it's the perfect amount and it's so much easier when they're so fragile and frail and they have they just lay there and have no give it's amazing to hold their head and just wash their um head with that little cloth washcloth and then you just throw it away when you're done they make it in the original scent and I'm pretty sure they make it in the lavender nighttime scent too. I love those things. I bought boxes and boxes when I had him because it was so much easier and it was a perfect amount and I could get everything clean. You just start from the head and move down and once you're done then you just throw it away and it was perfect. I love those. Um, let's see chest rub is always good to have also um saline solution is a must when your little one gets a stuffy nose it's hard for them to breathe you have to have saline solution and a little nose sucker which nose suckers usually always come in the hospital i know i got at least like three nose suckers in the hospital and um it's just the saline solution helps loosen it up and it's just so much more comfortable for them obviously having something shoved up their nose isn't going to be comfortable but it just breaks that stuff up i still use it on my daughter and she's two um so let's see i don't know if i have anything else i'm pretty sure i probably do other than like blankets and stuff like that but that's all like preference um I think that's pretty much it. If you guys have any, leave comments below so you guys can like give each other ideas and stuff. These are just my things. If I had, if I found out I was pregnant right now, which I won't, don't even try to get excited. That's not happening. Um, I would go out and buy these things just so I know that I have them. It's super important. I loved these things and they made my life so much easier when I had a baby. So I hope this helped you guys. Um, see you later. Bye.